Yes, yes, people, welcome to another episode of Team Talk. Today we're going to go over the Man United versus Copenhagen preview. We're going to touch on the Champions League um, roundup and also the Europa League roundup. Yeah, yeah come got, on. Got, <laughs> <laughs> going to touch on um, Gareth Bell, the Gareth Bell situation that is a bit mad. It's and bit um, mad still, yeah. yeah, we're just going to jump straight into it. Actually, Man first, no, do you know what? We haven't even introduced ourselves, you know. For real. So. <laughs> you guys even know who I am, obviously. I'm so sorry, man. The name's Jerry. Jesse. My name's Jax. And there you have it. Um, straight into it. We're going for starting lineups, the predictions. In goal, I'm going Sergio Romero. Yeah, it's under procedures, man. Yeah. Yeah. Um, right back, uh, Wan Bissaka. Yep. Yeah, I agree. Maguire, Lindelof, mm. and um, Brandon. Brandon Williams, obviously Luke Shaw is unavailable. Uh, midfield three. Uh, Matic, uh, Bruno and Pogba, standard. Yeah. No discussion, man. Bro, speak <laughs> properly. No discussion. No discussion. <laughs> At the front three, obviously Martial, Rashford and Sancho. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, banter. I'm joking. Uh, Greenwood, obviously. And um, yeah, everyone knows our starting lineups by now. I hope Oli, Oli doesn't do any, any funny business. Obviously Lingard came off um, early. So the Fred, game. so the Fred, and Fred, so it uh, looks a bit, a bit dodgy. Nah, nah, I, I, I don't. He knows that uh, he has to play the best team. Just him. Bro, why are you <laughs> drunk, fam? <laughs> what's, what's wrong with you? I told uh, your boy. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, let's so go. what prediction? How are we feeling about the game? I'm confident. I'm really confident. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the bridge is pretty dope, man. Uh, yeah. I mean, I feel brushed on my side. Um. Yeah, I think I think our, t- our squad has had a decent break. Strong squad. Um, if we kick off the way we kicked off, <laughs> man, this guy, what's wrong with you? Continue. <laughs> like, what was he saying? <laughs> if we kick off the way we kicked off, um, when we came out, of <laughs> hey, I patted up. What are you doing? <laughs> man, I don't know why this guy's got the giggles, man. Uh, <laughs> if we kick off the way we kicked off when we came out of lockdown. Uh, <laughs> Commercial break, commercial break. Yeah, see how we came out of lockdown and we were on fire. I think if we can kind of replicate that form, we would definitely win Europa quite easily. Yeah, I think, honestly, I think we're going to batter this team. Standard procedures. Going to the predictions now, I'm going 3 0. Standard win. Bruno, Marshall, Brace. Yeah, I'm going 3 0 as well. Um, I'll go for 2 0, I think. Um, one goal in each half. Yep, and obviously Champions League just rounded up this weekend. We've got the quarterfinals now. Man City dumped out Real Madrid and uh-huh. um, Juventus are out. Yeah. Uh, what else happened? Um, well, it's a Barcelona. Barcelona. Barcelona through and yeah. Chelsea got slapped. Absolutely by slapped. By Bayern. Um, but yeah, touching on the Gareth Bale situation, obviously he wasn't included in the squad, which I found a bit strange. So what are your thoughts on Gareth Bale and Real Madrid and how they're treating him? Um, boy, it's uh, I don't really know who's up. Well, there's always two sides to a story, um, but th- you can't deny Gareth Bale's quality and uh, what he does. And I mean, when, when there's certain matches where you just need someone to turn up, and he has done it over the past since Real Madrid's been winning, he's always done something yeah, in those, in those matches. So absolutely disrespectful, I believe. From from his part, from, from like the owners, the yeah, they just the team, don't rate they don't yeah. rate him. The fans even like. I don't really know about Real Madrid fans, man. They're, 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 I think they're the worst fans. Honestly speaking, like uh, Bell, Bell and Ozil is why well, they both had the same situations. That yeah. so honestly, no, Bell's won stuff like yeah, that's, no. that's, that's and he's been different. he's been pivotal in those matches. Do you know what I mean? I think he should just leave, man. Like no, but the wages, man. I don't think he's gonna leave. That's that's what I'm saying. Football's more about money now, bro. Yeah, it's what it is. That's why Ozil does. He probably doesn't want to leave Arsenal because of the money. Bell doesn't want to leave because of the money. He clearly, I think he said he wanted to stay even. Yeah. So, but you know, as, as much as we talk about football as an entertainment sport and we enjoy watching it, it's, it's a career for some people. It's money, isn't it? So true, true. Yeah. So um, yeah, we're just gonna round up on the quarterfinals of the Europa League. Our quick predictions: who's going through and whatnot. So first game is Inter Milan versus Bayer Leverkusen. Uh, I think Inter's got too much for Bayern. It's a, it's a big match though. Um, but I think Lukaku's on form, and when he's playing the way he's playing, there's there's yeah, he's just gonna keep scoring. Jesse, what are you saying? Um, I'm saying, yeah, I think Inter will win, man. I think they've got more quality. Obviously, Bayern, Leverkusen got Havertz, who Chelsea are linked to. 
apparently they're getting yeah. him. So is he would he play? He would play, innit? Yeah, he would play. So I think Inter win three one. Next one we're going to is Wolves versus Sevilla. Obviously, if we win, we'll face one of those two. Mm. Who would you like to win? I would like Sevilla to win. I don't know about that football heritage <laughs> and all that stuff. But you say, you see the word that word you said heritage. Our football heritage against Wolves is not nice, fam. No, that's true. Yeah, so, our, our, our record pitch. against Wolves is. It's I think so we bad. played four Premier League games. If I'm not Drew... thinking one. Did we win this season? No, we've yeah, drawn we've three both times, yeah. and lost one. We're just, they're just a bogey team. But, that's you, true. but you know what? Do you know what? Regardless of who we have here, it's it's our opportunity to put things right. Yeah, yeah I mean, true. So, so even if we get Wolves, I think we'll, we'll, we'll teach them a lesson. We'll see, right? It's a different team now, isn't it? So, yeah, quality yeah. team, proper quality, quality team. Yeah. Sevilla are one of those bogey teams. I wouldn't want to get Sevilla. I can't lie to you. Yeah. Now, I, I want to. I would like to play an. I would like to play Sevilla. Why not? Because I feel like when we play other teams from other countries, they won't really know how we play and they don't really like. Yeah. Mm. Um. When we tend to like score, like more goals against them as well. Yeah. So yeah. like well, I think Wolves like they know us in it from the Premier they'll League. Be, yeah. They'll have like, a strategy. I'll be kind of nervous. Yeah. They'll have yeah, a strategy yeah, yeah. out of. There's how... a one game off here now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, they, they can actually turn up and do something and actually yeah. beat us. They know how we play. Yeah. yeah, same way how Tottenham beat City, you know. Yeah, yeah. Know, even though we know City are a stronger team, so. Yeah. So guys, Sevilla, yeah. 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 And the last one is Shakhtar versus Basel. Um, Don't know too much about those. Yeah, teams. I think I think Shakhtar will have a bit more for for Basel, so I will Shakhtar. I will Shakhtar only because of experience of they've always been in the Champions League. Yeah. And. Mm. Um, Obviously, they tend to drop out, but I have bet them to beat Basel. Basel, they always they they get sometimes. Yeah, they sometimes get, but they always. Some I think recently they've been in Europa League. Yeah, yeah Basel. Yeah, Basel. They ain't been as strong as they used. Mm. Remember they knocked us out. I will never forget bro, bro. that. I will never forget that. That, that was a, one of the worst days of my life. Shakiri. Basel, you know, no, we didn't even get through the group stages. Horrible, horrible. What's that? Europa League. No, it was no, Champions League. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember yeah, Village yeah. got injured that game. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was mad. Oh, my God. So, what were you saying? Basel or... Shatter, Shatter. Cool, that's the roundup for the Europa League. Jumping into the Champions League quarterfinals taking place this week. Mm. First game is Atalanta versus Paris, PSG. Obviously, PSG are expected to win, but I think Atalanta, they're not... no. No pushovers. They did score the most goals in Syria. I so I thought he was gonna use a different P word there. No, no, I was. <laughs> I was. <laughs> but obviously you're trying to keep it PG. Yeah, man. PSG v Atalanta. Um if I had to put my money down it would be PSG, but just like you said. Um do you know what? Remember um beginning of the season I said, you know what, this might be PSG's year if they can keep their players fair. Yeah, and there's yeah. no Mbappe. There's no Mbappe. That's so, a huge, huge yeah, blow. That's another blow, but PSG I, I fancy them to still go through. I think. I f- yeah, I fancy PSG. They still have quality in their attack. They have Vacardi, they still have Di Maria, Neymar, and yeah, so a lot of firepower. Midfield, Ratti, quality. Quality yeah. And who did Atlanta play before? I can't remember. I remember they battered that team. Yeah, so yeah. they're coming up against a. Much but they've, they've been team, doing pretty so. well in the league, no? Yeah, yeah, they came. They came third. If I can remember. Yeah. So, I just. I, I think PSG will go through with. I think this is their time to shine now. If they go out, then they're dead. Okay. Yeah, I think they got the easiest like side of the draw. If they yeah. win, um, they will play. Yeah, they're not the... easy side. No, going no, to the no, next no. game, but like it's it's the easiest side of the draw. So like if they win, they will either play Leipzig or Atletico in the semi. So you say that, but bro, Atletico is a hard team to if play. Atletico go through. Then... Yeah. But you think they'll beat um Leipzig? Yeah, they're no Werner. Yeah, no team of yeah, Werner. That's a massive. They're expected what? to go through. Wait, how did Atletico... they make, how did they make that so before the end of the championship? It's Werner. He he. What did he, he just basically said? I'm gone. <laughs> and then yeah, they had to sell him. Yeah. Boom. So okay. what are you saying? Atletico through? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Atletico. I think this is this is that beneficial to them as well with this one game team because yeah, yeah, they, they, they know how to defend yeah. one result one nil that one nil they can yeah. easily just nick it like. yeah, and they still true. got quality up front as well so yeah. that, they, uh, they could they could, easy, they could be they could be dark horses they could this. easily go to the final luck on their side so mm. we're saying athletic for that one mm. the heavyweight clash of the quarterfinals Jeez, is man. Bayern versus Barca yeah, it's man. very tactical I'm know. I'm personally going Bayern Munich obviously yeah. Because they're looking like 
they're looking like a machine. Lewandowski's just moving mad. Um, the defense is good. Midfield, everything is just perfect. Yeah. I think I think I even said the last episode that Bayern were my favorites. But you know what? Yeah. yeah, they do this though. You know they'll be looking fire, fire, fight, and they'll get to like semis or quarters, and they will just lose. Yeah, they when was the last you know time they got to a final? Do you know what I mean? Um, wow. In twenty twelve, when they lost to Chelsea. Do you remember? Was it Real Madrid that knocked them out? Um, yeah, I think season. seven. Yeah. Was, yeah, they got banged that day. Yeah, yeah, it's just. And Liverpool done that as well. Yeah. yeah, last season. Yeah. Was that last season? Yeah, yeah last when Mane season. scored that yeah. mad goal. Because every, I think every season you can always put Bayern Munich as potential favourites. Yeah. But then there was four top. But I still, I mean, there's still one guy who's alive, and if he decides to, to turn up. Last game, yeah, it's yeah. even so, crazy. If you don't know what we're talking about, we're talking about Lionel Messi. Obviously, so. if you don't know, just yeah. stop watching, please. <laughs> but, I mean, yeah. Barca did get to the semi finals last year, so I will say Barca only because, yeah, that demon man. And plus, <laughs> uh, yeah, by me, yeah, they're on form, they played Chelsea, Chelsea are rubbish though, 7 1 and aggregate. I don't, f- I think buying against like a top, top team, yeah. they just tend to struggle, you know. Yeah, yeah mate. Well, this could be the year. This could be the year. Obviously, yeah. Lewandowski should win Ballon d'Or this year. He got shagged. I, I, I don't know why that. Sorry, that's to take this off topic. But I don't know why that got they cancelled. cancelled it. Uh, if they're gonna if they're gonna cancel Ballon d'Or, why well, do not cancel everything else? Exactly. It's tight though. Both of them are very good. It's tight. And so yeah. whoever, whoever wins. So you going? Yeah. You going for Barca? I'm going for. Yeah, I'm going for Barca. Are you going for Bayern, Bayern man? Yeah. I think Bayern have too much for them still. Yeah. I mean, as long as they can keep Messi quiet, I'll, I'll go for Bayern. And the last one of the quarterfinals, obviously, Man City versus Leon. Man City always getting these nice draws. Mm. <laughs> um, they get it, but they still don't win it. I so. think. I think this year, this is this is it. This is it. I'm going for Man City, three one win. I think Leon, Leon did not count Juventus, so they'll be on a high. But I think Man City will have too much quality up front for them still. Yeah, I I agree. I'm I'm gonna contradict it a bit though because I think. It's a one. If it was over two legs, I would have said Man City. But one game. Actually, yeah, one. The one game. Like things one game. And Leon. Scary. Seen, fam. Trust me, bro. And I've and I've looked at Leon's team. There's some ballers in there that can just. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And City's defense still looks pretty weak to me. It still looks pretty weak. True. So. Oh, what? In my opinion, I think it depends. He scores the first goal. Yeah. If Man City scores the first goal, I could just see them like beating. Yeah, I think them. if Man City just turn up, it could be. Easy. As yeah. if Leon scored the first goal. Yeah, it's a bit peak. Uh, yeah. Leon, they were defensively, they done well against Juventus, so... Yeah, exactly, exactly. Well, they, they, I, they, 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 well, I was going to say they managed to keep Ronaldo quiet. Technically, they didn't, but... Yeah, I back Man City to go through. Uh, do you know what? Man City, if you had to put your money on, on someone actually winning it from here onwards... I think Man City might be the favourite. No, I will not say they're yeah, the favourite. That's, that's what I said in the last right, right, I don't know why you guys say they're favourites. Because Man. look, look what at What about the... Barca? You bear in mind, Barca, could have, they were so close to the final, you know? Yeah, okay. So if... And they have that demon as well. Man, Man City don't why have you, no why demon. Why do you keep saying that word? Like that? <laughs> yeah, you keep saying that word. Well, God's children are here. We're, we're not <laughs> <laughs> trying to call no demons. <laughs> <laughs> no demons out here. I, I don't know why you guys are saying they're the favourites. No, no. I'm not, I just think I'm not they look like they need to win it. Like, yeah, the something say looks that different. Then. They look, they look on it. Like, I feel like you actually needs to win his so Barca. They, they, Barca have money for like five nine, years. Five years. Yeah, yeah. but they don't, Barcelona. That's don't a bit really sus. Yeah, it is. Five it's years. It's been a long time still. If if City be um, PSG, who's gonna go on to next? P- the, um, no. City beat PSG. Yeah. Oh. City beat Leon. Oh, sorry, sorry. City beat yeah PSG. Yeah, they'll play Barca. Not PSG. So Leon can play Barca. Okay, then that that will be the semi final. Semis, yeah. Okay, that's difficult. I'd That's back difficult. Barcelona to beat Man City, to be honest, with that defence. I, I would Man back City. Barcelona and Bayern Munich to beat City, though. That's what I'm saying. Like, if Bayern, I feel like Man City come against the laps of... Uh, ba- I don't know, you know. If Man City come against the against Bayern Munich and Barca. No, I, do I, back, Man City, I, I do not back Man City to Man beat City both. Man City have been them. Bayern a couple of times. Yeah, yeah, but they got. Well, that, yeah. That's not. But those are different teams now. Though. Look at you keep saying different. Bro, it's the same team. What's changed? Do you know what's Wait, weird? How's it the same team? I was changed. Who? What? Nah, but probably what, Gnabry the, and that. So is this Bayern team better than what it was before? We don't. We, we never know. That's what I'm saying. So what I'm saying is different teams that like the Bayern. Was that, was that in the knockout store or group stage? So, group stage. So what? There's something. There's something about City's team. Are you not? Really, you know who Man City is. Yeah, bro? yeah, but the, I don't it's, know. This ain't the Man City that they, they, they look a bit. They look. They still look. Mad, they still scored hundred percent. No, but listen, they still look a tiny bit weak somewhere. Defensively, they're not good. Defensively, they look a bit suspect, That's and true. for some reason. Without Aguero, they don't look as aggressive. No, but he's used in the last couple of games. He's played very well. 
Like, yeah, but he looks like. Who, who did Messi just play again? Madrid. Real Madrid. And he's played. He yeah, played sick. Yeah, yeah. But Real Madrid is not exactly I Bayern like, Munich, bro. I see Man City bottling in the in the semi final. Let's see anyway. Let's see. Let's see. But yeah, obviously the attention is on Monday nights. United take on Copenhagen. Hopefully, next time you see us, we'll be reviewing the game, and hopefully it's a it's a win. Because if it's not, hopefully it's positive. Bad. There's no hopes out here. Nah, it's going listen, to be United. A clean hey, please, win, man. just this should be standard. We shouldn't even be stressing out this game. It's Man United versus Copenhagen. Standard three 0 win. Please just get the job done and we move on to the semis. Guys, make sure you're following us. Make sure you're commenting yep, what your yep. predictions are for the quarterfinals and the Champions League quarterfinals. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you yeah. follow us on the socials. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace.